Hey everyone, so in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys the easiest way to record your iPad screen or live stream while showing your iPad screen. It's a pretty simple process and I'm gonna show you guys how to do it step by step. It's also completely free to do, so yeah, pretty cool. So the first thing you're going to want to do is download OBS. This is a free software that works on Windows, Mac, and Linux. So you'll go to obsproject.com, choose your OS, and it's going to download. The next thing you're gonna want to do is take your iPad, so this is actually my iPad Pro, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna get a cable that connects to this port and goes into the USB port of your computer. So you'll see that I have the iPad right here. I have the cable and this is going straight into the back of the computer. The first time you plug in your computer, it's probably gonna have like a, do you wanna trust this computer? And you're gonna to wanna to say yes. After that, you're gonna come here into OBS Studios and you're gonna to go to settings. You'll come here to video. You'll select the resolution that you want to film at. So I wanna film everything at 4K. So I'm gonna use uh, 3840 by 2160. You wanna use that same exact number for your output scale resolution. I set the downscale filter as this. And for the FPS, I just use 30, but you're free to use 24. 30 or you know 60 those are like the common ones if you don't want to record at 4k you can actually just do 1080p and that's going to be 1920 by 1080 and you're going to set that for both you'll click apply and then we're going to come here down to the scenes area and this is where you're going to click plus this plus button right here it's going to say enter the name of the scene so let's say we want to call it ipad test scene or whatever you want we'll click ok and here you'll see that uh, the scene has been created, but we don't have any sources uh, in that scene. So that means, you know, we're not gonna be able to see anything. The first thing you wanna do is click plus right here. And if you want to, you know, actually record what you're saying through your microphone, you'll come here to audio input. You'll click microphone test or whatever you wanna call it, click okay. It's gonna allow you to select the properties for microphone test and you'll select your device here. I'm recording all the audio directly through the Scarlett Focusrite, but if you have a USB microphone or whatever, uh, you'll see that right here, you'll just click it, okay. And now you'll see that the microphone is there and it has uh, an audio signal. After that, this is the fun part, you'll click plus again. And this is where we're going to add in the iPad. So you guys have already connected the iPad to your computer. You've already you know, said trust computer Computer, and you'll come here to video capture device. We'll name it iPad screen test. You'll see that I already have existing ones since I've done this before, but I'll click okay for this new one. And here I'm gonna select the properties for this one. And you're gonna come here to device. You're gonna select iPad. This should show up, bam. Okay, so we got the iPad connected. You're going to set the resolution. So if you're filming 1080p, you'll select this one. If you're filming 4K, you'll use this. I'm filming 4K, so we'll go with that one. And then we'll click OK. From here, you know, you can drag the size if you want to change that. I want it full screen. If you don't want to show, you know, this part, you can actually drag it beyond that and make it fill the screen a little bit more. So I can do something like that. But for most people, I think you'll just make it the regular size. So, and yeah, that's basically how you're able to record everything on your screen while also having a microphone input if you wanna do any commentary. And yeah, it's a lot more simple than people think. And it should take you guys maybe like, what, five minutes. If you wanna start recording, you'll press uh, start recording here and it's just going to record everything you see right here. And I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you guys did, make sure to share with a friend. You guys can reference this video at any time you want. And of course, like and subscribe for more videos just like this. We make a ton of how-to and guide videos uh, aimed at startups and entrepreneurs. So yeah, if you wanna get access to these videos when we drop them, uh, be sure to subscribe. Anyways, thank you so much for your time and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.